Hi, my name is Isabella Ferreira. I play Pilar Salazar on Love, Victor. That's premiering in June on Hulu. I pray for everyone in this family. Is everything okay between you and dad? Marriage is hard sometimes, even the really good ones. At least I never have to worry about you. Yeah, it's it's not exactly a spin-off, but it's in the same world as the movie Love, Simon. It's in the Creekwood High universe. So it's based off of a Latinx family. It's, um, you know, basically following the journey of this kid named Victor. I'm his little sister, Pilar Salazar. And um, I don't know, I'm kind of like a rebellious teen and I'm kind of helping my brother as he focuses on what he wants to do with his life and stuff like that, while also having to deal with, you know, the emotional traumas of like moving and just like being a teenager in general. She's the regular Latina teen. She's, um, you know, she's very sassy to say the least. She's a spicy character in the show. She's definitely gonna spice it up a little bit, but she's a freshman in high school. She's 14 years old and um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> Um, I think we're in this, we're the same in that uh, we know what we want and when we want it, we really go for it and you know try to get it. But um, in the way that we're different is obviously she's a little bit more rude than I am, I think. Uh, at least I hope I'm not rude to anybody, but she's not afraid to speak her mind. And sometimes I can be a little bit on the shy side and so like I'll steer back from that. So that's just a little bit of like what we are. Right. Um, it's been hard because everything's everything's literally shut down. The industry, um, my career is just kind of on hold, basically. But um, I've just been dealing with, you know, being with my family 24/7. So I've definitely learned a lot more about them. But it's been it's been fun because we get to like watch movies every night, and I get to like cook with them and stuff. Things that I wouldn't normally be able to do every single day, we do. Um, filming's already done. We started in September of 2019 and we ended in December and we uh, shot in Los Angeles. So we shot for about four to five months, I think, around there. I've had so much time to like, you know, check in on the, the fan base and we actually have a pretty big following on Twitter for some reason. Everyone's super active on there and everyone's so excited for the show. And it's been amazing being able to like reach out to people and see their opinions on things. So. I've definitely been communicating with them through there. I grew up a dancer and I did that for about nine years, but I've always loved like, you know, watching Disney Channel and all of that. I mean, I, I think that's a pretty generic answer, but um, I I was always a shy little girl and I feel like with acting and like being different people, I didn't have to be Isabella. I didn't have to be that shy little girl. And so I think that's when I really found my love for it. Cause I'm like, oh wow, there's, there's a job. There's a thing that I can do where I don't have to be myself. Um, or I can like put myself into another person, if that makes any sense. And so that's when I really found out. I was like, yeah, this is something that I want to do and I want to continue full time. When I was younger, I definitely didn't have the support um, like friend wise. I've always had family support. I love my family. But um, like when I was younger, people just didn't believe in me, I guess. And so that that definitely took like, you know, a, a turn in my life because I was like, oh, my God, should I even be doing this? But as I got older, like I have really strong friends now and I'm, I'm really happy to have them. And you make friends, like throughout the industry, you make friends. There's a lot of people that you're just like, ah, I don't know, but um, I, I've definitely made a lot, a lot of friends along the way and they're a really strong support system now. So if it's something that you absolutely love and you have a passion for, don't let anybody tell you otherwise, you know? They're like, oh, you can't do it. Oh, you'd never be there. You'd never get to that point. Like, who are they to tell you that? You know, what are they doing with their lives? You have to look at it that picture. Like, what what are they doing to, you know, to boost their whatever they want to do, their passion? You know, if you're doing something that you love, that's all that matters. So just continue with it because you never know. I mean, I, I didn't know for sure. That's for sure. So I have an Instagram called The Isabella Ferreira. I have my Twitter. It's The Isabella Rose. And um, my mom has an Instagram that she posts a lot of behind the scenes pictures of me. It's Isabella underscore Ferreira underscore life. And um, originally my Instagram was the Isabella Rose. And when I changed it to like my full name, everyone was like, why, like, why did you, like, what, what is that? And I'm like, well, one, that's my full name. Two, Isabella Rose. Rose is my mom's name. And I always loved that name. So I just kind of put that in there. Hi, my name is Isabella Ferreira and you've just been buzzed. <laughs>